Hey everybody, my name is Ivica. Thank you so much for being on my Unreal Engine beginner tutorial that will show you how you can quickly and easily create a material that is animated and it is presenting a multicolor surface. So a surface that changes color from A to B and B to A. In this case, we're just going to go with black and white. It's the simplest and easiest way to showcase the same process. And we're going to create a material that simply switches from A to B once you get it on a static mesh. To do that, we'll first, of course, create a new material by right clicking and going for material that we're going to call black and white. Now we're going to open it up with a double click. And right now its base color is going to be already black. Uh, it's the Unreal Engine as a platform just needs a second or two to get that showcased but without setting up anything that is the kind of base color in terms of having nothing there so the first thing we'll need is actually a sign node and here it is the black color which is going to be the basis of the same color change which we're going to connect to the base color from there, as you can see, we get the error message immediately. We need to get another node that precedes the sign node, which is going to be time. And we're connected to sign and the error is gone. And right now we should see the, because the sign node goes up and down like a sinusoid, we're going to see a change in this. Just let me save. where we see literally a blinking black and white sphere where the color changes from black to white in a pretty rapid manner. Now we don't want that, we want a slower gradual change so we're going to add a multiply node between those two and it will allow us to control the same output. Now right now the multiply node is at 1.0 the higher level you set the faster the change will take place the lower level you set it will take place slower so let's for example place 20 here just to see what happens we're going to save and now the sphere should blink like insane and the color change should happen in a really rapid manner we're going to then change it back as you can see it's blinking insanely fast we're going to change it to 0. Point, let's say 0. 0.15 and again we're going to save and now the change should happen in a much more gradual manner where the blinking is a lot slower and there it is the blinking is there but it's slow and gradual so let me dock this here and let's try out black and white in the game by simply dragging it to the static mesh here we have it and let's try it out in the game itself as you can see it's changing gradually and slowly as it should now we can now change this further on, expand these nodes, add a multicolor node to allow for more colors and each of them would be basically controlled through a similar setup. However, this is the most simple, most basic way to make an animated material that switches between colors and provides that effect of having a multicolor animated material in your game level. That's it for this tutorial, hopefully you found it useful, it's short and sweet and it's useful, hopefully again. Thanks so much for being here, thanks so much for listening and watching. If you'd like to support me, I have a Patreon page, I sell books on Amazon, you can send me money and crypto directly, but all of that costs money, time and effort. There is a way how you can support me without any of those and that is simply to subscribe to my channel and be here for my new videos, either my podcasts about everything and anything, or my Worlds of Gaming series where I kind of examine the lore of 
gaming franchises as short YouTube videos or as new Unreal Engine tutorials. So once more, choose any of these to help me out and I will be very grateful. But before that, I just want to say thanks for watching and have a great week, but also have a great day, have a great month, have a great year and have loads of fun in your Unreal Engine levels. Bye bye.